Melby steps out in her pajamas as she joins hairdresser pal Gary Madatian in Los Angeles. She settled her restraining order lawsuit against estranged husband Stephen Belafonte on Thursday, meaning divorce proceedings can now get underway. And Melby looked incredibly relaxed as she headed out in Los Angeles with her hairdresser pal Gary Madatian on Saturday, wearing a pair of comfortable pajamas. The former Spice Girl, 42, was the picture of confidence as she bizarrely stepped out in the blue and white striped sleepwear paired with chestnut Ugg boots. Her caramel-flecked brunette crop was slick back off her face and she covered her eyes with a pair of shades. A light dusting of makeup accentuated her pretty features. Her pal Gary looked cool in a cream t-shirt, white jogging bottoms, grey hoodie and baseball cap as he carried a leopard print suitcase. The outing comes after Mel and Stephen privately settled a domestic abuse claim on Thursday. Melby and Belafonte, 42, married in 2007 but the singer filed for divorce in March this year citing irreconcilable differences and claimed domestic abuse, which he denied. She claimed he repeatedly physically abused her and made her have sex with other women in threesomes, which he filmed. She also says he told her he could destroy her career if he decided to leak those tapes. Melby had sought a permanent restraining order against him. Belafonte, in return, made claims that Melby was addicted to cocaine and alcohol during their marriage, which she has said isn't true. The case was settled in a Los Angeles court on Thursday, which she undoubtedly hopes will prevent the sex tapes from being leaked. The settlement came after two weeks of trial in which witnesses were asked about their sexual history with Mel B. and Belafonte. The pair still have to decide on the financial details of the split, but after leaving court on Thursday Belafonte said he was the happiest guy in the world. I'm just glad the cloud of suspicion of domestic violence is no longer over my head, he told reporters. It's hard out here to be a man. But you persevere and you get there in the end. Melby's mom took to Twitter to say that news of the settlement isn't true, but the pop star hasn't made a statement herself. With the first hurdle cleared on Thursday morning, Melby and Belafonte can now move forward with hearings for their divorce. The settlement came just days before a two-week domestic violence trial was due to start. A judge cancelled the domestic violence restraining order that Mel took out against Belafonte months ago. But Sean Collinson, a family law mediator hired by her legal team, told Daily Mail, Miss Brown stood her ground and we replaced the domestic violence restraining order with a private settlement. Another restraining order Mel B, real name Melanie Brown, took out against the couple's former nanny Lorraine Gillis, 25, who claims to have had a seven-year sexual relationship with Brown, will stay in force till Monday, pending an expected settlement of that case too. Belafonte's legal team was planning on using 56 videos as evidence in the upcoming trial featuring Mel, claiming to show the star snorting, cocaine and inner sexual activity. Judge Jahaz said he would return the controversial videos submitted as exhibits by Belafonte, 20 of which showed allegedly sexual situations involving Brown, to Belafonte. However the judge warned that they may be needed again as evidence if the trial involving Brown's restraining order against Gillis goes ahead on Monday. The settlement comes after Melby parted was with high-profile lawyer Susan Wisner and Larry Bakeman just days before the scheduled trial which was a part of her bitter divorce. The former Spice Girl employed relatively unknown LA-based outfitter Shanna and Dotson law firm run by attorneys Claudia Rishana and Juan Dotson to handle the case and they had just over a week to get up to speed. Mom of three Mel B had claimed Belafonte tormented her with years of physical and mental abuse and the court has been told she alleged he drugged her through much of their relationship. He has denied the allegations and has claimed her habitual and consistent addiction to cocaine and alcohol was a major issue in their marriage.
The court has also been told that Brown led an extravagant lifestyle and had wiped out her $50 million dollar Spice Girls fortune.